First thing I'm going to do before I start on this driveway is grab a couple loads of this road base and take it over to the pole barn. I got a drop off there between the new concrete and the dirt. I just want to fill that in. I think it'll take about two buckets to do this. That packs down pretty good there. I'm gonna go get one more bucket. That should be fine for this. The rest of it, I'll backfill with dirt. I just need a way to go from that grass to that concrete. There's the second load. I forgot to turn the camera on. We're gonna dress up this concrete slab that we have going up into the pole barn. We had it poured a couple months ago and they pulled off the form board. So we've got to clean up the dirt on this side. What we have to do over here is fill all this in with dirt. And we're gonna use the clay from the pond over there that we dug out. And on top of that clay, we're gonna put some topsoil that we dug out of our driveway and get that smooth and get it seeded with grass so we won't have any more erosion on this side. So let's get to work. But before we get to work, let's, uh, let's say hi to Miss Piney Grove. All right, what do you think? Hello. <laughs> what do you think about all that? I think it's going to look really good because it does look a little um, unfinished right now because it is unfinished. So once he gets on his uh, little tractor and... Whoa, right, little so tractor? Once he get a, gets on his big manly tractor <laughs> and then fixes all this, it's going to look great. His tractor doesn't have a name. He named his excavator Precious within 10 minutes of having it, but he's not named his tractor, and I think that's unfair. So... What you think his tractor name should be? Comment below. It's not gonna be Petunia, just saying. First thing I'm gonna do is knock down this edge. This is too steep to mow, so knock that edge down and then put in some fill dirt right here. When you get a concrete poured, they come in and take the form boards off after the concrete sets, but they don't fix or back blade or do anything with the dirt that they dug out. That's normal. It's expected that you will do that. So without a tractor, we wouldn't be able to do this work out here. So we really like our Kubota L3901. It does a great job for us and we're not sponsored, just impressed. Time to get some dirt. We're doing, baby. We're doing, Dad. I've got quite a few loads of clay up there. I'm gonna go grab some topsoil now, put on top of that and just kind of mix it in, pack it in. What I don't wanna do is overpack the clay and then the topsoil can't kind of fill in the nooks and crannies. Nothing's gonna grow in that clay. Give my helper. Gonna come out here and sweep that off so it'll be nice and clean. Bella's digging. Deb is sweeping. How's it look? Looks really good. It's a lot better than it did. Looks more 
finished. And now we have Deb and Bella in the same frame. Except Deb's sweeping and Bella's making a mess. Yep, that's not helping, Bella. Bella, that's not helping. No, stop it. Look at her nose. Bella, look at Daddy. I see her. <laughs> I need to get a little more clay for that area behind me, but this area is almost set and you'll notice that this dirt is a different color than that clay. And that's because it's the topsoil and organics that we dug out of our driveway. So I brought some of that over here and pushed it down into the cracks and crevices of this clay. And the idea is that once I get some grass growing here, those grass roots will hold together this topsoil and kind of bond it to that clay. That's the idea anyway. I think I've moved enough clay now along this pole barn edge and also along the ramp here. So I'm gonna spread that out and pack it down, then go get some more topsoil, and then I can put the grass seed down. I put the bubble on the camera perfectly level. That's how much of an incline I'm working on. That's going to do it for today's video. We'll throw some links up here to a couple of our other videos. But until next time, y'all take care. And remember, life short, tractor hard.